Yo, 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 yo. How's it going? No, Spirit Dude. Spirit Dude, where are you? Uh, come back. How's the face? How's the face looking? Apparently, apparently, Spirit Dude is too busy with something to talk to me. Oh, rip. How dare he? How dare he have a life outside of outside of me, huh? Rude man. Hey, Kliska Sharta Hendrik West. Welcome back, sir. Fantastic to have you here again. Yeah, I don't know. I guess he's doing something. Something that's more important than uh, than gracing his uh, us with his presence. Oh, but um, what will happen is I will be on his stream tonight, talking about stuff for a longer period, and I will be painting um, at the same time. So it's, he he does like artist interviews for. An hour or two or so on, on on Firestarter, but anyways, I'll I'll be hosting it. Um, so you just go to my channel and you'll get notified. Oh really, Henrik? Congratulations, man! Bravo! Hey, Georg! Welcome back, Georg. We are pleased to have you. <laughs> hey, Zelian, how's it going? Happy Friday, everyone. Um, hey, Yatsuki. Good morning. So, I'm on a dark fantasy roll. Give me a, a, a dark fantasy topic. I'll paint it. Uh... Recorded the one from. Oh, you were typing. All right. <laughs> hey, good morning, Jenny. What's up, Jenny? Uh... Hey, Cameron Brown. Tour? <laughs> am I am I tour all of a sudden? Lantern animal. All right, I can I can swing a lantern animal. Hey, Oms, how's it going? Dark fantasy paying taxes, nah man. That topic is not gonna do. An ant. Fanatic Inquisitor. That's pretty cool. Soul Reaver. Soul Reaver. The Corrupted Shadow. Ice Wizard. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's some pretty dark topics. Um, let's, let's do a dice roll. We got it enough, I think. So as per usual, it's not this dice, but the one when I roll. And let's go. Number two. Oh, sh pom shit, Pomfret, which is... Uh, so, Lantern Animal is one. Paying taxes, I'm not... <laughs> I'm not including into the role. Um, ant. Jenna got it with Ant. That's pretty cool. That's a tree, tree creature, right? I should write end by Jenny. Jenny. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Cameron, I'm not gonna make dark fantasy paying taxes. <laughs> That's I can I I will take that as a, you can be you can you can feel robbed, Kappa Kappa. I'm not gonna do paying taxes dark fantasy style. Spirit dude, oh look who's who's too important to Show up on time. Rip, rip, rip. Shame on you. 
Shame on you, sleepyhead. Hey, cut, Sam. How's it going, man? Apparently, spirit dude, you you uh, you're too good for me, huh? Huh? You think sleep is more important than me, huh? You do you do you? How dare you? How how rude! <laughs> Shame! <laughs> Cameron Brown, you know what? On Monday, on the Monday stream, if you show up on Monday stream, and um, if you show up on Monday stream uh, and give a topic, I'll do that one. Right? Just to be fair. You actually did win, but your topic was shit. <laughs> <laughs> so I oh, I vetoed your topic. Cameron, absolutely you can hold me to that. Show up on Monday morning and name a topic. But it has to be a good one, right? Can't be paying ta dark fantasy paying taxes. <laughs> I reserve the right to question your choice <laughs> because your track record isn't amazing so far. <laughs> Spirit, uh, no man, I'm not drunk. It's morning. Come on. Come on. Sharta, yeah. Show up on Monday and give it a go. You're gonna win one day. Like, uh, who was it? Was it Wanamir who, who always said Panda? Panda? Or Urian who was, was it Man Bear Pig? Man Bear Pig every day for forever. And then finally he got Man Bear Pig. I think it was season two. There's been a few topics that keep keeps on popping up. That's true, Zealin. <laughs> uh, that's true. I didn't think about that. I told him to come on Monday, but I've already promised. But I mean, if Cameron doesn't show up on Monday, then yeah. Cameron has one, 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 one point in history. Oh, really, Jenny? That's cool. Hey, Jesus, how's it going? Yeah, the, yeah, that's right. The, uh, <laughs> no, Cameron has. If Cameron shows on Monday, he got Monday. But that's if. We'll see. We'll see with uh, Cameron Brown. Mr. Cameron Brown underscore or Cameron is Cameron a, a woman's name or a man's name for me it's quite in, in my mind it's quite neutral Cameron could a woman be called Cameron Cameron or is it a man's name I don't, I don't know actually it's, it's uh, an American name isn't it Cameron uh, Cameron Brown yeah sure Go ahead and ask. <laughs> oh, Cameron. No oh, snap.
Cameron Diaz. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Camera Ronald. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, but like I said, uh, <clears throat> I'll be on Spirit Dude's uh, stream uh, tonight, uh, which is in the morning for you Americans. I will be hosting the stream, so it will be here as well, so you can find uh, Spirit Dude's uh, stream too. <laughs> the yeah, it's a good day today. Fun, fun Friday. Um, in terms of weapon design, Cameron, oh yeah, weapon design is a beast of its own. Um, uh, one thing for me when it comes to weapon designs, if you want to want the weapons as in, I, I'm assuming firing weapons, um, or do you mean melee weapons? I assume you mean guns and uh, stuff like that. Seven minutes in, I, I got a I got a good base at least to work with. Seven minutes in, I'm I'm not enjoying this uh, symmetry though. I, I think I need to need to switch it up a bit. Oh, melee weapons. All right. Um. For melee weapons, it's all about, um, for me, is the combination of shapes and materials and selling, selling the material and the state of the material. Um, and uh, like, does it, did that make sense? If you're gonna design something, you, it has to be believable, especially if it's a melee weapon. You can't, like with all designs, you can't just mash too much in there, and it's it's not gonna be believable. And uh, to some degree, proportions of the design, you know, how the size of the blade versus the handle, uh, or uh, you know. Where do you put the spikes on the mace or the baseball bat? You know. Hendrik, that's a good point. That's a good point. I can put in some size reference. I was imagining that it's like that size. But for back to the topic of melee, um, it's all about materials and shape design. If it's a um, question of um, firing weapon, then uh, for me, it's all about functionality. And 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 um, making sure that for for both both things, it's about making sure of how you're going to spend majority of the time looking at the weapon. Is it the first person or third person? Um, Cameron, if I if I sacrifice it, functionality, personally. You can uh, you can um, you can uh, bend the rules a bit, but as long as it doesn't come off as completely impossible, you know, 
because in the end you want you want the viewer of the design or the player to want to pick up the item right a good exercise in in practicing is to practice designing um levels of weapon you know like this is level one and this is level 100 of a mace and uh, what elements do you um, kind of boost up to make the design come across as as more you know epic or more 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 um, how do you incentive incentivize uh, the player visually to to want to pick the weapon up right and of course the 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 more high level the weapon is um the l the more extravagant it's gonna be right and then functionality is still gonna be the same as level one right to some degree of a of a mace right you, you club you go, still gonna club the the enemy with it but you know there's there's room to navigate within that hey eric 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 welcome man cameron yeah absolutely absolutely there's there's parameters like that that you have to make sure that it comes across you know it's uh, you understand it at glance the function of it but uh a club can be done in many different ways, in many different materials. Uh, but you can't make it so complex that it's hard to understand it's a club, you know. Hey, Max! OMG. Max Grek is in the house. My pleasure, Cameron. At any point, if you have any questions during the stream, let me know, man. I'll do my very best to explain. And that's for anyone else. If you have a question about something and you think I might have an answer to it, <laughs> go ahead and ask. But yeah, I, I, and if you, we're going to go with shooting weapons, you have to be really careful with the mechanics of a weapon. You know, like, um, where's the trigger, uh, where's the magazine, where's the um, ejection, um, where does the shell eject? Um, and do you watch it in first person or third person? And then a lot of design information should be dealt with according to uh, first person or third person. A gun can look great from the side, but shit down the scope. Uh, and if you play a first-person game, it's going to have to be all about down the scope. Right? It has to be look looking good down the scope, and not so much from the side. And a lot of games make that mistake. They design f side view instead of uh, down the scope for games that's first-person. Hey, Mila! Welcome. That's an evil Groot. <laughs> yeah, it could be. Could be. It's a dark fantasy end. Ah! <laughs> That's that's cool, Eric. It's just just a stick, yeah. Yeah, clubs are clubs are a vicious weapon, actually. Like the medieval clubs, they're nasty. Like, not only am I going to smash your armor, but I'm also going to spike it at the same time through the armor. 
so you get penetration wounds and uh, blood force. A dark end, yeah. This guy is no mercy. The good thing about designing a wooden creature is that uh, I can just do one one material pass because it's all going to behave the same. It's all wood. But I was thinking, should you you guys can decide decide should this ant be on fire? Should it like be burnt? Is it a uh, that kind of dark ant? He's on a mission to kill humans, and he's on fire. I was thinking if he's going to be on fire, not like fully burning, but like burn edges and embers and stuff like that. <laughs> Eric, yeah. <laughs> It wouldn't. Oh, Chinsrand. Oh, Chinsrand. Your puns. Tree sap. Swamp tree end. Um, yeah, I think. Tree sap. It's going to be hard to visualize. Um, but we could try it. Does this give me too much work to do? Maybe not. Where, where am I? Halfway, approximately. Okay. I'll try to. A waste of time, really. No, I'll do that next time. Max Crick. Uh, yeah, I, I used to do spit, uh, spit paintings. Spit paintings. Arms, you can? Alright, that's cool. I'll, uh, I have no idea how that works, and I don't want to experiment that uh, live, but uh, it's a good idea. Thank you. Here, Max. Here's um, like a few years ago, I did speed paints, and there's more, more on my website. Layer matting. Max, oh, that's cool. That's cool. Cheers, guys. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. Uh, I did a lot of them. It's fun to do, but it's the same as a warm up. It's, there's no difference, really. Oh, 
I will definitely uh, experiment with that uh, arms. Thank you very much for it. That that's a great. Uh, I don't know how it works or how well it works, but uh, it's always good to learn new things. So cheers for that. Puppet tool. I haven't tried Puppet Tool. I know what it is, though. It's like you can put skeleton in, right? And, like, shift proportions around. Or rotate limbs. Yeah, I mean, Matt. <laughs> Matt is obviously for matte painting. Photo, sh fo uh, photo bash stuff. But I mean, um, it could, it would work as well. I, I think on on cleaning up the edges. So we're over time. Eight minutes. Okay, quickly. Put like something that looks like fingers and feet. Kind of like roots. I'll work your wood. <laughs> like a carpenter. Like a dirty old old wood. And don't clip that by the way. <laughs> Cameron, you and Chilstrand, you can be besties. Chilstrand loves puns as well. <laughs> yeah, you better. You better, sir. I'm going to hold you to it as well. If you don't show up... Oh, man. Shame on you. Everyone. Everyone will point and laugh and go oh, ha, ha, ha. Cameron missed his opportunity his golden ticket rip rip yeah <laughs> that turned out well. uh, <laughs> yeah I'm gonna out you I'm gonna I'm going to hang you on the wall of shame. I'm going to make a specific area of the stream for the wall of shame. And I'm going to put your name in there. 
Yeah, it's almost a lantern animal. And you're you're absolutely right. But it's not though. It doesn't count. Yeah, tree is no animal. True. An ant wouldn't be regarded as an animal, would it? It would be a creature. <laughs> Lava! <laughs> oh, no, man, there's no wall of shit. I should, though. Like the top five shittiest suggestions. <laughs> I would. Would it. I wouldn't get zero rec zero topics then if I would have a wall of wall of shitty topics shape wall of shame. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. Would be horrible. Three minutes. Oh snap, oh snap. I don't know, I'm not keen on those eyes. It made it look 2D. Was not the fan of those eyes at all. Mm. No, I don't like the head. <sighs> Stupid head. Needs to be finer details there, not too stylized. It has to be feel a little bit more dangerous. Yeah, it'll be good. That's good enough. Hey, Jenna. Yeah, Spirit Dude. <coughs> Where is Spirit Dude? <coughs> I, I thought. Uh, do you know? No. Uh, he doesn't know either, but Spirit Dude was supposed to. He was supposed to. Huh. War <laughs> correspondent. <laughs> that hurt my my heart. Oh, rip, rip, rip. Hey, Tigian6. Extigian. What up, yo? Welcome to the very end of my stream. So I think um, I will be on uh, Spirit on stream tonight, um, early morning for you Americans in the West. Um, I think I'll continue on this one on the stream. We'll see. We'll see. Um, Cameron, I'm gonna 
be waiting for you Monday morning. You better show up or you're going. I'm, I'm going to actually make a hall of fame, shame, a wall of shame. If you don't show up on Monday, you will have a wall of shame. You will be hanging on the wall of shame for the entirety of Monday if you don't show up. Just so you know. Um, when his stream is, I don't know. I I will host it on my channel, so just have notifications on, and you'll you'll see me pop up. It's gonna be for like a few hours. It usually is. So. Yeah, the spear dude stream. Yep. 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 Yeah, something like that. Something like that. Probably more than six hours from now, because obviously six hours from now is going to be six o'clock in the evening. We'll see. Would you ever braid? I could braid it, probably. Which down to here? All right, let's see. Um, let's see who we can raid. Who can we raid? What's Christopher Kent doing? Oh, he's making an orc. All right, let's raid Christopher Kent. Is that how you spell his name? Christopher Kent. Yeah, it is. All right. Thank you, everyone, uh, for coming. Have a great night. Have a great day. See you guys later. Um, <laughs> Cameron, see you on Monday. See you on Monday, Cameron. Anyways, catch you guys online uh, on on Spirit's stream later. And uh, have a good one. Let's uh, raid this guy and uh, outro time. <gasps> Bye, everyone. You guys are the best. Thank you.